Ray, welcome back to Pokemon the Indigo Disc. We got some League battles to get on with now. We, um, where am I going? I, I, <laughs> like it's awful. Where am I going? I'm going north. Alright, we're heading north. We're going this way. We could potentially uh, skip and fly there, but if we fly, we don't get all the extra doodads. Nor do we... Alright, I'm not climbing this mountain. We're gonna f slightly fly, okay? Fuck. Great, I'm glad you helped me, phone. I don't want to do that. No, why is that the same button as the map? Oh. I don't want to use that. Oh, God. Yeah, I mean... Ugh. Uh. It's tempting. Uh, we're gonna go here because it he robs us of seeing Pokemon that we might not have seen yet. Um, we need to capture some because we need a bunch of Pokemon um, to do the, the the camera lady's quest. Obviously, we need to clear the Pokedex. Um, I just don't think we need to clear the Pokedex. That's what we thought we had to do last time, isn't it? We cleared the Pokedex, thinking that's what we had to do. We don't actually have to clear the Pokedex. We just need to get 200 Pokemon. We just need to get too much Pokemon. We weren't far, far away, right? We weren't that far away. Why is the game bugging out so fucking much? Uh, we actually wasn't that, that far off from having 200. So that's that's not too bad. Random shit. Close to like 50 of them. I never understood how holding a stone can make you lighter. I'm also gonna get that BP so we can unlock the other areas and catch the starters that we need. That's for sure. Hello, welcome to the Coastal Plaza. We are team of supports Miss Lacey. Is the Elite Four? Go strife right. Oh, the BP League challenges. Yeah, that's me. You need to hand over 50 bucks. You wanna play? Yeah. Cool. Why is our phone pink? Wasn't it red before? Thank you very much. You really received and noted. <laughs> we need you over here, Miss Lacey. Coming. I get her voice. Oh, is it strife? I'm so glad you decided to pay me a visit. Please follow me if you want your trial site. Shit, yeah, we gotta do the trial. We gotta do those trials. The Coastal Plaza to challenge me. I'm really sorry for the way I protested you by joining the BB League. Of course, it's true, it's quite irregular under the bylaws of the student clubs. Uh, but many I don't want to get dragged into the drama of troubling club lately. I suppose our trial's already officially begun. No, so let's uh, get to it and have some fun. It's a Pokemon quiz. I'll ask you five questions about Pokemon. You can answer them all correctly, then you pass. Oh, okay. Are you ready to take my quiz? Listen, why do we have to come all the way fucking out of here for a quiz? Yeah, alright. I'm ready. Great. Then uh, just to get everything ready. Okay. There's a bigger you. That's your knowledge is a broken one. Okay. Question one. Alright, here we go. And look, it's everyone's favorite Pokemon, Pikachu. Everyone's favorite Pokemon, Pikachu. Everyone's favorite Pokemon. This is question one. Pikachu is an electric type Pokemon, well known for producing electricity within its body. Okay, which part of the body does it store its electricity it generates? Go, go right for the body part you think is correct. <laughs> Stop pointing, you freak. Um, I think it stores it in the cheeks. Ding ding ding, you got it. Uh, Pikachu stores electricity in its cheeks. If you're, if you poke the sacks, you get a little shock. But, uh, 
Don't you think they're just super random and cute? Now then, I think we're ready to move on to the next quiz question. Okay. Oh no, here we go. Take a look at Ben that here. It's bigger than you think it would be, isn't it? But it's also so fluffy and squeezable. Terribly adorable, really. So here's question two. Um, even on the darkest of nights, then that are able to use a certain body, body, certain part of its body, like a radar, which allows it to detect its surrounding, surrounding object. Which part of the body acts like a radar? Your right part, pick the body part. It's got to be the antenna, right? It's got to be the antenna. Oh shit! This is the eyes. Totally the eyes. You can just see in the dark. Give you a hint. Looking quite a large part of the body. This is the eyes. Wait. Hi. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Eyes. Oh, I thought that was too obvious. I thought oh, it's probably the antenna. <laughs> Oh man, we got screwed. Ding ding ding, that's right. It's has big eyes. It has the radar. Isn't then that even more adorable than you think? The whole world can't see? Yeah, sure. Now I think we're ready to move on to the next question. I do like them. Oh fucking hell, here we go. Getting wary of my quiz. How about a cup of tea? Or maybe three Susanna siblings? Here's question three. Uh Sensity, sensity, uh, like to live in precious antique teacups. There are a lot of uh, phonies out there. It's hard to tell with a cup that generates antiques. Of these, freeze antenna is a as an antique form, uh, meaning it's found a real antique cup. Which one is the real deal? Um, you know what? I was uh, actually told this. Uh, by my friend, uh, they have a little mark on their like on their butts, so they just need to like let it like spin around. That one does. That one's a fake. Want to do a little spin? That one's a fake. Must be this one. Let's wait and see if we can see the mark. There it is. See? Go mark. Good job. Good job, Noel. Ding ding ding, you spotted it. That's right, an antique form can be recognized by the mark on the bottom of its cup. It doesn't matter whether they're antique form or phony form, they will sit down cute. Well, it does, because only the antique form can evolve, right? <laughs> uh, I think we're ready to move on with next quiz question. Okay. First of all, is this the Meteor Pokemon? Minnow. It comes in all kinds of different colors, you know? First, I'll actually take a good look at this pinkish mineral for me. Okay, have a good look. Uh huh. Uh oh. Oh shit, hell. Alright, guys, mix yourselves up. Oh, that's fucking harsh. Okay, right, now you're ready for question four. Which of these is the pinkish I first showed you? I think it's this one. Yo, I've been. I. I played Mario RPG on my Christmas break. I did all the Yoshis. I know. I know this this game. If they return from their media form, they managed to find the right one. Are they adorable? It's not really a question. That was just a game. Now I think we're ready to move on to the very last question. Now, I feel like you ran out of questions. Final question. Oh look, here comes a grumble. Maybe it heard the word pink. Decided to stop by. This little sweetie is one of my own Pokemon. So he didn't stop by at all, he just got out of his ball. It's always with me. Our last question is question 5. We involve Grumble here. Grumble is quite delicate and lovable Pokemon, of course. But you can tell me this. When I take a nap with my adorable Grumble, which body part do I use as a pillow? How the fuck do I know? be his fucking ear earlobes for all I know. I imagine it's a tummy. Because why would you use anything else? That's a stupid question. This is a dumb questionnaire. I like the first two questions better. Ding ding, Sally is the adorable tummy. But I cuddle up to it, it's so soft and cozy. 
go to sleep just in seconds. That's the end of my quiz. I managed to get all five of my questions right, which means congratulations! Officially cleared my elite trial. Okay, so that was kind of lame. As a as far as these trials go. Um, however, I 100% do prefer a quiz to doing some random bollocks, like making a sandwich. <laughs> so, <laughs> the least imaginative one. However, I am the most acceptable acceptance of that one. Since you passed my elite trial, you've earned the right to battle me. So what do you want to do now? Ready to move straight into it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go. Got it. No time to waste then. Right, let's get started into our positions. Okay. Okay, this should be far enough. Let me properly introduce myself for this. I am Lacey, the Elite Four. I didn't really expect to get a challenge from someone like you, Strife. Rightfully, you do belong to a different school. Honestly, I'm a bit shocked, but I won't let my personal feelings get in the way of our battle. Uh, so, uh, let's see. First of all, I should tell you, I mostly use fairy Pokemon. There's there's just nothing like adorable pink fairies, right? Sure, I don't think we actually have a fairy type on our team. They're weak to poison and steel. Well, that's generous of you to tell me that. Uh, anything uh, caustic or cutting uh, doesn't suit them. Oh, but you know all this already, right? Now, for the battle... I'm not going to hold anything back. I want to be sure you walk away with a proper understanding after all. Right, here we go. Turn to play Lacey, the BB League. Oh, Whimsicott. Love a Whimsicott. This time I'll be facing you in my usual party as a member of the Elite Four. No plus or mining situation this time round. Alright. Hmm. Hmm. I feel like the poison jab. Poison jab in the Whimsicott. Try and get it right away to prevent this sort of shit. <laughs> Maybe we should have um, brick bricked in anticipation of that. It's a rock solid strategy. Going after weakness. Oh, what well, a poison touch off there. Love to see that. Oh, that's a rough one. Probably avoided it. But that's fine, that just means the wind of the cot is dead. Marina. Oh, interesting. Um right, brick break. It's not very effective. But just hit it anyway. Oh fuck a duck. <laughs> Oh no. Okay. How do we deal with Queen Marina? We get Castle, I guess. Because it is Water Fairy. Use the Ice Punch, but ain't no one there, brother. They dead already. Alright, let's get Castle out. And. Hmm. Yes, the Ganther. He's got a steel move. So hopefully he won't just die. Intimidate, get that attack down as well. That's great, that works out for us. Alright, Castle. Hit it with a wild charge. I forget what these moves do. Uh, it also damages us slightly. Okay, but it's only a slight damage. Not a big damage. Uh, smart strike the grumble. All right, we're much faster now. That's better. Ooh! That's a much needed damage. 
that was not as good as I thought it was going to be. Green Blast, that sounds bad. Oh, okay, that was brutal. Play rough, of course. Of course it played rough. All right, Baham, in you go. Spark the Primarina, because that needs to get the fuck out of here as soon as possible. And we're going to Max Potion Castle to make sure it happens. Castle should go first, so it shouldn't be too bad. But we can't get uh, our boy Chocobo out on the field whilst that Primarina is in action. However, I think Fairy is good against Dragon, isn't it? Is that right? It's slow, bro. That is also not great for us. That's a poison one. Um, oh, no, it's poison, not water. Hold up, it ain't water. Hold the fucking phone. It is not water. That's bad. Um, hmm. I'm a little worried by it, actually. Quick draw. That's unfortunate. Okay. I can't believe how fucking strong these ones are. Look at that. We got the burn off, though. That's great. Scold is such a good move, man. I love Scold so much. Okay, we're gonna get we're gonna get our chocobo out and shadow claw the slow bro and then we're actually gonna revive some people we're gonna revive some people because we're in such a shit shape i can't believe it we're gonna be fighting tooth and nail to win these battles which is great actually I mean, this is good that they're like pretty rough Yeah, it's gonna suck. Yo, I didn't mean you'd kill me! Oh, Church Bar, I know you were weak to it, but I thought you'd at least... At least do a little. Oh, shit and hell. You're in fucking bad shape. You're in real bad shape. Um, okay. Max potion for each year, which is um, actually really bad. That's just gonna screw us, isn't it? Thing is, I don't know who could be strong enough to survive a move. Are you dark? Yeah, too dark so he, the psychic doesn't go through. I think that's the move here. And then we'll max potion you. Oh, you go. F like, fuck off. You should not go faster than the terrestrializing. Oh, okay, he doesn't. He doesn't. He doesn't. Okay. Okay, I didn't see that one coming. It was the right move. <laughs> it was like absolutely the right move. Didn't like that kind of hit. That's just not right. This is random. Get over it. Yeah, the burn is probably going to take Grumble out.
Um, or I guess smart strike. Level are they? Are we, are we like under leveled? Surely not. We're like level 80. Okay, the grumble is almost dead. No, we're actually ahead of them. Actually ahead, wow. These guys have got their like stats in the right place, eh? Alright, Baham's doing a good job of staying alive and tanking shit, so we're gonna keep Baham going. And whatever Grumble does this time around, I think he's gonna get it killed. Perfect, that sucks. They won't be dead. Oh! That leftovers. Oh, what the hell? You just got leftovers too? Alright, that's Grumble down. Extra drill. That's interesting. Hmm. Skull should really fuck it up. Um. They are gonna max potion it again though. I'm gonna see what it does, because I think it's gonna transform into a fairy type anyway, right? Yeah, here we go. I'd argue, I'd make the argument that using this <laughs> crystal mechanic makes sure Pokemon are less and less cute, but... Whatever you like. Yeah, that's brutal. Okay, that's rough. Giga Drain. That's really fucking bad. <laughs> oh no. That's really fucking bad. What do we do here? We've hit Fairy. So the problem is. If we revive someone, I thought they were just gonna die. We need a poison jab off. Yeah, I should do. He's in flying. Aeroblast. Shit. Shit. I can't believe how powerful these Pokemon are. This shit is no joke. Okay, so Creamy's all set up once again. Um, are we fucked? I think we're fucked. I think there's literally anything I can do. I mean, obviously, we go for the poison jab. But I would have to go ahead and assume that they would miss. But I honestly think if they hit us with any move, guys, we're gonna die anyway. Um, just gonna have to hit, go for it. My horse battle is probably the worst 
possible fucking outcome we could have. Oh dear. Um, also we literally start just literally right in front of it. It's not cannon. It's a only cannon. We lose. Okay. What the fuck? How the fuck do I beat her then here? Um. I mean, we can just level it. We can just level everybody, but I don't really want to just do that. You know? Um. We've got tons of shit to sell. Um. We could sell a bunch of this shit. I go make some money. And give some actual, uh. You know. Items to our. Stat stuff to make them a little bit more. Competitive levels. And then. We'll come back, I guess. Can I do it at a vending machine? Can't sell it at a vending machine, which makes sense. Um, no, it doesn't have the right things either. Okay, I'll do that in the break and try and get some stats up for our for our team. And then we'll come back next time and we'll come in for the rematch. That was brutal. I was expecting... I'll, I'll be honest. I was expecting victory. I, I was not expecting it to be quite as brutal as it is. Uh, clearly, clearly they need some more training. So uh, we'll make it happen. Um, have we got Connie? We have got Connie. We need, still need to catch some more Pokemon for the uh, for the lady. Uh, right. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you all next time. Bye bye.